Okay, I'm gonna review how I do a vertical alignment of my prism pole and how I make sure that that is indeed level and how if it's not level, how I would calibrate it. First thing I do is obviously head up my total station, make sure that this is level, turned on and connected to my tablet and looking at the bottom prism on the prism pole. And here's a close up look at my prism pole. I like to put a prism at the bottom and a prism at the top so that I can measure both the bottom and the top and see how I need to adjust the top prism to make it perfectly plumb over the bottom. I then come to my tablet and I go to the vertical alignment application. And when I'm in the vertical alignment application, I can open up the side menu over here and I can start. On the bottom left, it says measure the first point. And right now I know I'm connected to the bottom prism, so I'm gonna press measure. Once that measurement is successful, I'm now gonna move the total station to look at the top prism and I'm gonna measure again. Now I've moved my total station to the top prism. I'm gonna come on here, and I'm gonna say measure second point, so I'm gonna do just that and press measure. So now you're gonna be able to see that I'm getting a live read at the top of what the uh, horizontal distance is between the two points. So obviously I know that there's a slight error, and at the bottom it tells me I need to correct it. And it tells me that I need to move the, total, the top of that prism rod to the right about a 16th to be accurate and forward about an eighth to be accurate. So I'm gonna go ahead and make those adjustments right now with my bipod. I'm gonna go ahead and adjust the, the bipod to move that top to be perfectly level. And I'm gonna inspect my bubble to see if I'm willing to accept my bubble on the top of my prism pole. So I've completed making my adjustments and uh, you know, I know it's bouncing between a zero and a 16th. It's very, you know, that's a very small measurement, so obviously it's bouncing based on how I'm even walking on the ground, but I'm going to be willing to accept that. So my correction is zero, meaning that I know that I'm exactly vertical. The bottom is right above the top prism. Now let's look at my bubble. Let me zoom in here. And my bubble looks pretty good. Now, if that bubble looked off in any way, where if that bubble was not lining up to a vertical prism rod, I would go ahead and go to the bottom of these screws down to the bottom and I'm gonna go ahead and adjust those and let me show you how I do that. I have like an Allen uh, wrench here. I can just pop it in the bottom there and I can turn these left or, to, left or right, loosen the uh, bubble up, adjust the bubble, and I should be good. I just push the rod, which is why it looks out of level. But uh, obviously you remember that it said it was definitely let on, but now obviously I've moved it when I put my screw in there. So you gotta be careful, obviously, to maintain this, main, keep it level, and then use the screw to adjust those screws, loosen up the bubble, make sure it's perfect the way you want it, according to what the uh, vertical alignment is telling you it needs to be, and tighten it down, and then your prism rod should be calibrated. Hope that helped.